As you know, we're introducing seven new models in 17, and I have the great pleasure of introducing you to our flagship, the Insignia Grand Sport. So back in 2013 at the Frankfurt Motor Show, I had the great pleasure of unveiling the Monza concept. That car was the inspiration for what I call Design Cycle 2.0, the evolution of our design philosophy sculpture artistry meets German precision. But what's more important is that car was the true inspiration for the Insignia Grand Sport. It really did influence everything we did. The first thing you notice about this car is the gold front end with this grill that's almost turning back on itself. It gives it a like shark-like nose. When you sweep back, the grill is very landscape and wide, giving the car a very low, wide impression. And then this beautifully fluid lamp, really slim, exaggerates that proportion. Let's talk about the lamp in a little bit more detail. Firstly, the wing signature lamp which is on all opals we've had that since the original insignia and this takes it to the next level with this double wing signature light but the real element of this lamp is the new matrix led headlamp here which takes what we've already introduced on the astra to a whole new level of sophistication proportion is everything in design so with this vehicle as I mentioned, to get to a premium feel, one of the first things we wanted to do was push the front wheel forward relative to the cabin. That is something that definitely gives this aura of confidence and proudness. So this proportion was very important. But then obviously as you work back through the vehicle, we definitely elongated the wheelbase further to liberate interior space. But in doing that, we really stretched the silhouette of the car and this coupish feeling really gives the car this dynamic quality that really makes it feel very sporty, dynamic and upscale. Another level of refinement that clearly ties into our design philosophy, sculpture artistry meets German precision, is the fact that it has these beautiful flowing sculptural shapes. The first thing when you see the side is you really notice the athletic stance, how everything is purposeful and bulges around the wheels to really make it look like an athletic, powerful car. As you flow down the vehicle, you can again see the beautiful surfacing and flowing shapes, again accented by these crisp lines of precision and the really well-constructed dynamic lines that really add to the dynamism of the car. All this really flows through into this tail end that gives it that accent and again gives the gesture and dynamic quality to the vehicle. An extension of what I talked about on the front with this double wing signature, again in a very slim profile, to really accentuate the overall width of the car and give it this really high-tech look. So now let's go inside and and talk about this wonderful rear seat package. As you can see, I've got generous amounts of space in this car. We've actually increased the leg room, the shoulder room, and the head room. I'm one meter 94, and I've got generous amounts of space around me. So let's get in to the best seat in the house. And once you're in, the first thing you notice is how low you sit in this car. You really sit in it which really gives you a great connection to the road and definitely fits with the driving character of this car. It's a very sporty car and the driving position really fits that very well. So there you have it, the new Opel flagship, the Insignia Grand Sport. And I hope you like it as much as we enjoyed designing it.
Let's go.